Hi, how you doing? My name is Jamie Boyle, and I'm from Aurora, Ontario, Canada. Now, I know your rules specifically state that only Americans can participate in your game show, but under the circumstances, I'd like you to consider my new idea. Why not make the show international? Sure, then you can have contestants from all over the world. Europe, Asia, Australia, Germany, Canada. That way then, it would make it even harder than it is today. Sure, you'd have language and cultural barriers, not to mention political barriers, which would make it even tougher. I can't think of a better Canadian contestant than myself. Now, what would make me good for a Survivor contestant? Well, in my experience from watching the prior editions of your show, I found that there are a few traits that you need in order to survive and eventually win the show. Number one, you have to be entertaining. You have to be able to entice the crowd to bring in the new viewers. And I have that tenfold. The only way you're going to find that out, well, is to meet me yourself. Number two, you got to be athletic. you got to be able to withstand the rigors and all the competitions that you put forth towards your contestants. Now, I come from Canada, home of ice hockey. There isn't a sport I can think of that, for, that requires more mental and physical toughness than hockey. Number three, you gotta have cunning. You've gotta be calculating. You've always gotta be thinking what's going on around you. Now see, I used to be a private investigator, so I've learned to look, listen, and learn. Now, the show isn't that easy. It's not just sitting around in hot tubs in the middle of winter time. No, there are other things you have to be able to do, like catch food. That's one of the hardest parts of this game. Now, I am, on the other hand, am very good in wilderness cooking, and Captain, wait, just as we speak, look at that over there. Oh, wow. That looks to me like the wild Canadian supus, Latin name Canis supus scutus, I believe. Oh, this is a treat. Just for your viewing eyes only, I'm going to give you my family's trade secret on how to catch that elusive and tasty delicacy. Now, the key is not to just jump into it. See, you'll scare them off. Now, due to their limited amount of arms and legs, their mobility is severely hampered. So the key is, is to slowly move towards them, not giving them any sort of idea of what's going on. And then out of the blue, oh look, a bird! <laughs> Dinner time. See, I told you I could do it. Now in conclusion, I'd like you to accept, consider my application for your game show, and remember that even though I'm not American, think of what I can offer this game show, and I'd like to put an ending to that old saying of nice guys finish last. So I thank you very much for your time. Do you have a can opener, by the way?